Last time on Corpse Party. <laughs> now let's continue where we left off. I found out what I had to do and god damn it I missed it completely. I guess I had to interact with this blood stained wall. Whoa. What the is that blood? And then that happens. So let's go in. It's completely empty. It's completely empty. They are completely empty. Yep. Yep. And I, this is what it was in here. No wonder why I can never find it. Naho notes four or five. Kibiki, I'm so sorry. My readings were far too bre broad, and my interpretations of them overlie naive. This place is not the simple plane of spirits I'd previously sur surmised it to be. Surmised it? I don't know. If we don't get out of here ASAP, we'll be in real danger. I something something E something G B E way out. Stir ta chill. It's what the heck? Would she write this with her nose? It'd be quite amped at something. Doing so will me. Why am I reading this? I can't understand any of this. It would be unamid danger. Tell Miss. I, 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 okay, I intend to keep my in investigations until a more reliable method is found. Until then, please, please be safe. I want to see you again, Kiwiki. More than anything. I want to feel you. I want to feel you stroke my hair. Oh, I thought it was gonna say stroke me. <laughs> There's so much blood on these pages. They're hard to read. I know. It just is. There's a skeleton sitting in the chair, wearing it with white scrub and a pair of glasses with circular lenses. All right. <laughs> And in class 1A, the fifth notebook is here, or the note, I should say. Naho note 5 at 5. The pages are all blanked. Okay. These pages, just looking at them makes my head throb. It's like they're somehow filled with emotions, like Naho's feelings have been projected into them. I can smell him. I'm getting closer. Soon, I'll be with him again. The letters are just appearing on these blank sheets of paper. It's like they're being written right now in front of my eyes by a ghost. My consciousness is fading. My hands are jet black, but I'm all right. I'll be with him again soon, after all. Naho notes 605. I found you, Kibiki. I found the room you ran to. Wait for me. Naho notes 705. I miss you. I'm going to hug you now. Naho notes hashtag of five. Everything has gone dark. My body is a black mist. What the hell? Naho? Naho is in trouble. Naho, what are you doing in here? Naho! 
Well, if it isn't Ayumi Shinozaki, how are you holding up? Naho, I'd like to share, share with you some information I've gathered. You have my attention. What did you find? A lot of bad things. With your name on it. So Sachiko was the perpetrator. I had no idea. Very interesting indeed. Thank you pro for providing me with this valuable data. However, you've only solved half the mystery. You have yet to determine who exactly Sachiko is. There's still a lot of ground left to cover before we've learned all there is to know about this school. Lady, we know who Sachiko is. She is the only damn spirit left in this school that wants to kill us all. At any rate, there's someone I need to find. If you please excuse me. I'm not done talking to you yet. But I've lost interest in what you had to say. Who was that boy in the staff room? I wonder. Giggle. Was he a classmate of yours? A brother, perhaps? There's a bond of love between you. It's what keeps you going. I would enjoy it, so if if more people would like would have that what the what the what the hell did I just read? I would enjoy it, so if more people like that come around for me to watch, it's quite interesting or entertaining. Why did I say interesting? God damn it! She's laughing at us. It's not even funny. Naho, I'm disappointed in you. Oh, you are. Um. Now, why would that be? Weren't you a veritable fangirl of mine? It's because of this. Ah. What is this? Sachiko and the ever, ever after crap. And what are you are the ruins of the Sachiko Shinozaki estate? Naho notes three of five. Here and I will detail the proper observation of Sachiko Shinozaki charm as well as the means of reversing its effect and returning home. Pay dirt. I don't get it. Why am I so confused? Sachiko in the Ever After. Procedure for proper observance. The spell triggers in the phrase, Sachiko, we beg of you. It must be chanted once for each partic participant. Then one additional time for Sachiko. Follow this, the proxy doll is to be torn apart. Should the proxy doll recover from the re ruins of the old Shinozaki estate be unavailable? A printed face symbol will suffice for the purpose of the ruins. If everything is performed as indicated, the spirits will pass by harmlessly and non nothing of note should occur. If any part of this ritual is performed incorrectly, though, then Sachiko herself will descend upon any viable spirits medium in the vicinity, and all present will be affected with her curse and spirited away to the sacred ground. Procedures of reversal: If you've angered, uh, if you've angered Sachiko, you may atone by redoing the ritual properly, but in reverse. First, produce your remnants of the proxy dial. You intentionally put the wrong directions on your blog. You wanted the ritual to fail. Did you do it for him, your beloved? Your mentor, Mr. Kibiki? Were you trying to make sure he had a large sample size to study for his, this, his article? Ha 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 ha, ha 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 ha, ha 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 ha. What the hell is so funny? You think you're so smart, huh? Well, you're not. So go fish. Well, lady, I would go fish, but I don't have a fishing rod, no worms. There isn't even a fish around here. So what do you want me to go fishing at? Oh, wait, wait. That's not what you meant? Oh, now I'm confused. Go fish? What the hell does that mean? She's saying it's a lie. Oh, I never heard of that one before, but I'll have to write that down. 
anyone who takes stuff posted on the net and swallows it wholesale is a fucking dumbass. A total retard. Okay, maybe I am. You're shaking. You can't tell me what... You can't tell me what you didn't have the slightest inking that it never crossed your mind something like this might happen. How many people did your little wind send to a slow, painful death, huh? God damn it, and I can't read for crap. You're the one who spread Sachiko's curse across the entire country. You! Don't you think I know that? But Kibiki, my dear Kibiki, smiles at me when I do right by him. Oh, Kibiki, my sweet, succulent mentor. I would do anything for you. Anything at all. But you occult freaks, you can all go rot in a corner for all I care. Gasp, hick. You're a horrible person. Horrible, horrible, horrible. God, how could you? It's my duty to protect my dear mentor's job, and I won't let anyone get in my way. Naho, you died here. And? Do you remember what you were thinking when you died? What you were looking at? I don't, actually. That's the one moment I just can't recall, in fact. No matter how much I try, it won't come to me. Your selfish egotism costs you the person you love most. What? You really don't remember, do you? Your very last actions as a human being, after you lost all hopes, but before you died... You weren't swallowed up by the corner, probably because of your ability, but you did succumb to the darkness. Look at this. Uh-oh. She's gone crazy. She, she, do you get it now? You killed him. You killed the man you love. You killed Mr. Kibiki. You took his life with your own bare hands, literally. And now she's going crazy some more. Is she going to go in the corner and freak out? Uh, what the flip is that? Oh, yeah, yeah, I forgot. I forgot. She, she was possessed. Wow. Sputter, moaned, wretch. Now she is probably dead. And gone for good. Give me a break. Is this some kind of horrible movie or something? Well, it's something. Sob, gulp. You okay? Acquired baby statue. Oh, now let me go give it to them. And we, what the heck, we just lagged there. Ugh. Naomi. It's here. The black mass that attacked me earlier. The sign says infirmary, but whatever is at the end of this hall is nothing like anywhere we've been before. My, my head. Big brother. It hurts. Mine, too. Ah, you both got nosebleeds. You two stay here. I'll go on alone. I can do this, because I am a man. Gasp. What the hell? Is that a child's face and hands on the, in the window? There's a posting attached to the door. Sachiko cleaning up in the infirmary room. Please wait here for me until I'm done. Mom. Sachiko! The door open. Come on in. Gasp. What the hell? Blood? Oh my god, it's mine. Where did, when did my nose start bleeding? Wheeze, wheeze. 
I think I'll be in danger if I stay in here too long. But I get the feeling there's something here I need to need to see. Let's go see it. Come on. What do you say? Shall we go on a field trip together over summer vacation? Am I moving? Oh no, I'm not. Oh god. That that that's pretty scary. What's going on? I can't move a muscle. Have I been paralyzed? Uh oh. Oh, she doesn't look that scary from there. My dear Sachi, she's my pride and joy. She'd do anything for me. That's pretty scary. Whimper. Gas, pant, wheeze. Diary. Whose diary is it? This spirit? The book seems quite old, with yellow pages and flayed edges, but the carefully linked letter are still completed legible. What? 7-19-1953. I seem to be dead. No. That can't be right. I can't forgive. I won't forgive. I'm going to kill. How dare you harm Sachiko? And who the hell is skipping? I'm not pressing a damn button. How do you harm me? This is bad. Can I get the hell out of there? Oh, okay. Guess it goes by itself, I guess. Satoshi! Naomi, Yuka, stand up. We have to get out of this hall now. Big brother! Come on. We gotta get the hell out of here. Sure wish I could hear it. Can't hear a damn thing. Pant, 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 hack, wheeze. Are you two all right? Uh-huh, I'm fine. I'm okay too. The headaches subside. It must have been that hallway. What was that place anyways? It was the nurse's office. There was a woman there with a broken neck. And just before I ran out, children started appearing all around her. Ah, Satoshi, is that? Yeah, it's the diary from the desk. I tried going through that earlier, but it was totally frozen in place. I couldn't even turn the pages. That's because in your dimension, it was a decoration. God damn it. Is it that woman's? Without a doubt. I saw her writing in it. I saw her written in it? Writing in it? What? There's a name on the back. Yoshi Shinozaki. I'm not sure what we'll learn from it, but I'm willing to bet it's something important. Shall we take a look? Go. 7 19 1953 I spoke at great length with the child again today they're so full of life and growing up so fast the younger students are quite are quiet and respectful too it's clear their parents love and care for them very much and have taught them very well but I won't be left behind I intend to raise a Chico with just as much love and devotion as any of them Today is her seventh birthday. We're meeting after school and going out for dinner. I hope she likes the stuffed cat I bought her. Had to sort out some documents in the reference room before meeting up with Sachi. While I was working, the principal dropped by. After he and I talked for a bit, he suddenly came up to me from behind. He grabbed me and forced me down, then began unbuttoning my blouse. He'd always been so kind, lending a sympathetic ear to my problems. But today, he didn't even seem like the same man. His eyes were cold and empty. I was in such shock. I'm not even sure exactly what happened to me after that. I slipped away somehow, and he was right behind me. I only made it as far as the landing on the stairs. Just as I turned the corner, I felt him push me. 
The floor came to me fast, and suddenly I found myself unable to move. I was slumped across the ground, unceremoned some word, and I was dead. Buckets of blood spilled out from my head. I'm sure it was hell to clean up later. I also lost control of my bowels. Embarrassing to say the least. I was slipping away, but I was pulled back by the sound of a very dear voice. Sachiko was ev was saw everything. I guess she'd come to find me. The principal closed in on her. What we hit, what was he planning to do? I yelled with every ounce of my strength for him to stop, but I was dead. I had no strength. Sachiko tried to run, but she had the stride of a seven-year-old. He caught her easily, and then before my very eyes, he strangled the life out of her. What a cruel man. He rebuttoned my shirt, then took Sachiko to the basement and buried her. He'll probably say my death was an accident and report her as missing. I'm not a bad person. I don't deserve this. There is no redemption for what he's done. 720, 1953. It's just as I suspected. According to the official reports, I slipped and fell, and nothing's been said to anyone about Sachiko yet. The other teacher and, st and students are all mooring me. They're so kind. I'm in mornings. I'm in mornings too, goddammit. 721-1953. There's a stranger sitting in my chair. A new nurse. The new nurse, no doubt. But no one comes to see her. She must be very popular. I hate her. 726-1953. Little by little. I'm losing my mind bit by bit. I'm fading away. A dark will, not my own, had begun infiltrating my being. Make it stop. Oh, Naomi's getting interested. So she was Sachiko's mom? It's so awful. Yeah, it is. I, f I really feel for her. What, though? Isn't anyone else bothered by the dates of these diaries entries? Sachiko shouldn't even be there. The kidnappings and murderers didn't take place until 1973, remember? Oh, you're right. There are all dates and full 20 years earlier. But what does that mean? I don't know. We kept reading. This post-mortem diary continued to chronicle school nurse Yoshi Shinozaki laments and regrets and detailed her agony. Bound to the side of her demise, Yoshi eventually exhausted all possible topics, filling the remaining pages with short passages like, I'm so alone, so very alone. I want to see Sachiko again. I want to see the children again. I will never forgive him for what he did. I'll kill them all. I'll kill them all. Among other similarities, Mournful or angry sentimentals, whatever. What the? I can't open it past this page. After a certain point, the diary pages become so bloody soaked that they were all sticking together in a coagulated mess of ropey paper. Skipping past the bloody section, you the very last few entries in the book, all of which were dated around 20 years later. 7-12-1973 Sachi is my pride and joy. She'd do anything for me. She'd even kill lots of people to keep me company. She sent me so many children. I love them all. 7 15, 1973. I have to make her stop. This won't make me happy. Sachiko, please stop. 7 16, 1973. His family is just as quiet as his family is just as guilty as he is. I'm going to curse the entire line forever. I'll burn some sense right into their brains. 7 17 1973. How did this happen? Sachiko, who died alongside me 20 years ago, has a flesh and bloody body once more. She kills children and sends their souls to me, but I don't want that. That won't make me happy. Sachiko, please come to come see me. Talk with me. 
1973, so Chico kills six more. And when they die, it's like every trace of their existence is removed from history. It's spiriting away in the trust sense of the term. But she's not capable of abducting and killing children on her own. She makes that man do the kidnapping for her. Sachiko, please stop. 723-1973. Sachi is no longer killing for my sake. Now she's just killing because she likes it. I don't know when this change happened, but it did. Living beings are suck, fickle, easily angered cre creatures. They killed us after all. I can't forgive anyone who killed another human being. I'll kill them all. I'll kill them for what they have done. I'll show them no mercy. 724-1973. Kill more. 725-1973. Kill more. 815-1973. Bring me more. 918-1973. Thanks to Sachi, I'm no longer alone. She sent me three more adorable little children today. Sachi is my pride and joy. I don't think she even recognized me anymore. But I still love her with all my heart. 1118-1975. The school's been closed down, and the principal jumped off the roof. Served him right. I think I'll sing with the children something fun and happy. What a pitiful way to die. Serves him right. 1123-1973! Sachi's been wandering the halls. These empty halls. She kills anyone who enters, people who've heard rumors, or are just curious. She and I are both so desperately thirsty, but there's nothing we can do about it. After this, the writing becomes too jumbled to read. God! So Sachiko's been killing children and sending them their souls to her mother so she won't be get lonely? And I guess eventually, it just drove her mad. It seems like deep down, even her mom wants her to stop. Uh-huh. Yeah, I'm not sure exactly what we should do next, but if we're going to get through to Sachiko, then it looks like the school principal is the key, if I recall the principal office is in the other building. Damn, that was a long speech. There's a stuffed owl in the shape of a black cat lying in the middle of the floor. Pick it up. Acquired black cat. All right. 